We're at 746. Good morning. Time for News Extra on KNEB. Today brought to you by Jolliffe Funeral Home. And we're going to visit about all things West Nebraska Arts Center. And uh, Mason Burbank is here. Morning, Mason. Good morning, Dennis. Thanks for having me here. Welcome to the program. Yeah. You have some exciting uh, things happening all the time at the Arts Center, but this time of year in particular, it really gets special. We do. It, it gets very busy this time of year. Um, we've got our current gallery exhibit is the North Platte Valley Artist Guild Holiday Show and Sale. And um, that exhibit, it'll be uh, in the gallery through the end of December. And uh, that exhibit has an open house coming up. Um, it's gonna be the Saturday after Thanksgiving, that's Saturday, November 24th, 10 a.m. to 4 p.m. And uh, we, we bring out new ornaments. Uh, the local artists that are featured in that show make ornaments, holiday cards, um, any kind of uh, holiday themed art and it's brought out for that open house. Um, there are also the artists that are in that show are going to be present in the gallery making art um, so it's kind of a fun thing um, you know people that come visit the gallery can actually see artwork being made um, if you have kids bring them um, we'll have stuff for them to do um, there's you know going to be all kinds of uh, desserts and, and we'll have coffee going it's, it's really a fun and, and relaxing time in the gallery. And this is on Saturday after Thanksgiving. That's right. Yep, that's coming up. Uh, I think a little faster than I'd like sometimes. <laughs> yeah. Coming and, fast. And uh, 10 to 4. Yeah. Um, in that exhibit, we also have a silent auction going on at the same time. Um, the members of the North Platte Valley Artist Guild created artwork and donated that to benefit the Art Center. Um, so that's on silent auction um, today. And... Uh, it's going to continue through that open house until 3 p.m. Um, on the 24th. Um, so people are welcome to come check out the exhibit, but also see that silent auction and uh, place their bids for that as well. Okay, very good. So that should be uh, terrific. And then the proceeds of that help fund things at the Art Center. It does. It, it benefits the Art Center. Um, you know, about the open house, when people come in, you know, if you need to purchase holiday cards or... Uh, original art for somebody, any purchase you make is really doing a lot of good in our community. It supports a local artist, it supports the West Nebraska Art Center, it supports North Platte Valley Artist Guild, and it supports the scholarship. The uh, North Platte Valley Artist Guild does an annual scholarship that benefits an, a local art student um, every year. So part of the proceeds from the exhibit goes to benefit that scholarship. So um, your, your simple purchase of Christmas cards actually does a lot of good in our community. Mason uh, Burbank is our guest. We're visiting about all things West Nebraska Arts Center. Now, somebody is new in the community and says, Art Center? Where is that at? Tell me about it. Yep, we're at the corner of uh, 18th Street and 1st Avenue. And uh, hours, uh, we're open Tuesday through Friday, 9 a.m. to 5 p.m., and then weekends from 1 to 5. And it's totally free. You don't need to be a member of the Art Center, though we'd encourage it. Um, but no, it's, it's totally free to come check out the gallery, and uh, everybody's welcome. There's really a lot to see. Uh, the current exhibit has 25 different artists, a lot of different styles, techniques. Um, it's, it's just really neat to see. Um, so come visit, have some coffee, and uh, have a relaxing time in the gallery. Wonderful. And uh, we'll visit about uh, some other events coming up at the Art Center right after this. Comforting. Personal Jolla Funeral Home. Okay. Let Jolla Funeral Home help you honor those you love when they've passed with unmatched service and artistry. Now we're going to start our uh, carry on member tickets at that open friends. house. With okay, over 100 like, years yeah. of experience, okay. we offer Come professional back, and personal back. attention to every detail in the planning process. We also offer advanced planning as a continuation to our services. That's Jolla Funeral Home. Our family serving your family for three generations with Mason Burbank from West Nebraska Arts Center in uh, Scotts Bluff. Mason, we uh, mentioned uh, that you can come to the Arts Center without being a member, but uh, we would encourage memberships, and that's gonna kinda kick off again at this open house? That's right. Um, at the open house, we are also, we'll start um, selling tickets to our annual fundraiser. We're doing a wine tasting um, that's gonna be Saturday, January 19th, um, 7.30 to 10 p.m. that night. Um, that's an adults-only event. It's a wine tasting, and uh, the proceeds of that benefit the Art Center. The tickets are available to members of the Art Center first, and uh, we'll start that during our open house. That's going to be the Saturday after Thanksgiving, uh, November 24th. If you're not currently a member of the Art Center, um, come visit us that day or call the Art Center. 
Um, you know, if you join membership that day, you can still get your discount on uh, member tickets. Um, so that's great. The Art Center is a 501c3 nonprofit organization, so um, your money just goes to benefit the programs and activities that, that are offered. Wonderful. So jumping ahead then, that wine tasting is uh, in January. Yeah, that's coming up. It's, it's got a really fun theme. Uh, this year it's going to be Hollywood and Vines. Um, so our, our wine tasting is going to have a, a kind of a movie flair to it. And uh, we're encouraging people to show up in costume. And it's I think it's really going to be a fun time. January 19th. Let's uh, back up and catch one of the other really uh, popular events here in the month of December, or most of December. Kicks off in uh, November here, but it's the Box Lunches. Bach is a B-A-C-H box. Yes, yeah, those are coming up. Um, that's their, uh, just another, I think, really uh, fun and relaxing time in the gallery. Um, the Box Lunch, uh, we have local talent that comes out and, and performs for those. Um, Robin Schmidt will be here for November 30th. Um, the WNCC Collegiate Chorale and uh, Select Ensembles, they're going to be here on December 4th. Um, also December 4th that evening, we're doing a box dinner. Uh, and the vocal trio, Yes Ma'am, will be performing for that. Um, and then our final one on Friday, December 7th, uh, will be a lunch with the artists where uh, a lot of the members of the Art Guild uh, will be present in the gallery and that'll be a chance for people to stop in and have some lunch, meet the artists, and see some artwork being made. So, so how, how do the lunches work? Are those um, they're an actual catered? box, yeah. like B-O-X lunch, yeah. and uh, they'll do a sandwich and soup. Um, the uh, meat shop with the Gearing Civic Center does an amazing job with those every year. Um, and it's, it's just really, it's wonderful, it's good food, uh, great entertainment, pretty relaxing uh, lunch and one dinner in the gallery. Wonderful. Well, you've uh, attempted the taste buds for the West Nebraska Art Center. How do we find out more information? Yeah, um, you can stop by the Art Center. Again, we're the corner of 18th Street and 1st Avenue in Scotts Bluff. Uh, you can call the Art Center, that number is 308-632-2226. Um, you can find us online and uh, find us on Facebook as well. Okay. Uh, WNAC.com or how, how much you the website? That's right. Um, www.thewnac.com. Okay. Very good. Well, we uh, invite folks to the open house on Saturday, November 24th. And kind of jump from there to all these other activities as we go through the season at the West Nebraska Art Center. How many members do you have? Um, there's about 250 memberships, so always looking to see that number grow. Um, we, we offer a lot of really great uh, activities and, and gallery exhibits throughout the year. Um, we typically have about 12 exhibits annually, um, so every month in the gallery there's always something new to see. Uh, it's totally free to come and visit and check it out. Um, we also, uh, Children's Theater is one of our projects, um, so we do that every year. Um, we have classes and workshops, uh, the box lunches, there's just really a lot going on. So, um, that, that support goes to uh, strengthen a lot of really great programs. Yeah, very well. All right, thanks Mason, we appreciate your coming by this morning. Thanks so much. And visiting about all things West Nebraska Arts.